The manhunt for an ex-cop accused of killing four people, including two police officers, appears to be over tonight. Going up in smoke on a California mountaintop. Good evening. Even as Christopher Dorner's flight from justice apparently came to an end, he claimed another life. And that's before, quite likely, claiming his own. It began to unravel this afternoon when fish and wildlife officers spotted Dorner on Big Bear Mountain. There was a gunfight. Dorner fled in a car, which he eventually wrecked, and fled to a cabin. Two deputies arrived, and they were shot, one fatally. SWAT teams quickly surrounded that cabin. Then about four hours ago, more gunfire. Police fired tear gas into the house. Then a single gunshot inside. Short time ago, police removed a charred body that was apparently Dorner's. Law enforcement is a very close-knit family. Uh, all law enforcement agencies is a brotherhood. So uh, this is a very difficult day, uh, again, for law enforcement. No official confirmation yet, but again, the most wanted man in America, former police officer Christopher Dorner, is believed to have killed himself in a California cabin as police set off tear gas canisters. That led to a fire that is believed ultimately to have claimed Dorner's life. Also breaking tonight.